Hey, what's up everybody? It's Chris coming to you with another one of my crazy crossroads. Big Joey C, Big Rob, Urban Ghost, Urban Explorations here with me as usual. We are at uh, the Haunted Mausoleum and also the uh, cemetery it's attached to. We're going to probably use the Necrophonic app just to see what we can pick up here and uh, maybe get some answers on what the heck is happening. So we'll see you guys on the inside or the outside. Deuces. All right, so we're gonna head inside, um, do the necrophonic. We just decided we're just gonna have a good time. Let's have some fun tonight, a few laughs. Try not to get too creeped out. Um, I was gonna bring some Entenmann's so we can sit down, have a nice little coffee clutch inside, but anyway, we are heading in to the mausoleum. Oh boy. Uh, what the hell did you see the size of that lizard? Where did he go? Looks like a greyhound. I'm sitting in the middle. I want you guys on my either either end. As long as Rob said, as long as we can hold hands. <laughs> All right, so <clears throat> that smell, yeah. About this door now. It's easy to pop open because you just stick something in here, but it is locked, and it's just a uh, just a storage area. Right this, oh, I see. That's the stick to put flowers up top there. Oh. All right, so we're... Well, do you have your phone? Oh, Chris, do you have your neck? I have it, yeah. This is perfect. I don't have my camera, so... Hopefully, um... <clears throat> hopefully I don't get too many phone calls. But uh, I want to sit in the middle of the couch, and I want to have you two big, burly gentlemen snuggle me in. I should have brought my Snuggie. Oh, come on, we should have brought some popcorn. <laughs> oh god. Hi. Here we are. Hi. Now, this is good. We're having fun tonight, guys. So we're gonna make a fun and scary video, hopefully. And Rob's joining us on the other side of the camera. Come couch. on, Rob, get in here. You <laughs> big burly <laughs> bastard. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Uh, Notice Rob put his what the on. hell just happened? The spirit took me over. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at this. Uh, this is great. Okay, so let me make sure that uh, this is picking up right. All right, so we're doing a little uh, what they call menage a day camera. This is perfect. So we'll do our little camera set up here. Bing, bing. Look at that. There. Oh, look at this. It's this great. great. It's great. Is my yeah, camera fuzzy, fuzzy though? It's fantastic. Better not be fuzzy. Fuzzy woozy. Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear. Look, it's all fuzzy. Maybe the light needs to go up, I don't know. All right. Wait, you know so, what? I need to move this. Here. 
Look at that, Rob. Rob's got that camera. So we have three cameras running. We have this camera, Chris's camera, and Rob's camera. Menage a day. Menage a day cannon. <laughs> All right, and we're gonna do, guys, tonight we're gonna do the uh, necrophonic app, see what we pick up. We had so much fun doing videos this past year, and it's kind of fun to do a video that's not as serious, just have a good time. Still see what we pick up. I think that I'm curious myself to see if my dad's name comes through, which is Tom. Um, some names we picked up in the past was Bobby. We also picked up, um, uh, was it Samantha? Samantha? And we picked up, um, of course, us. Our names. So let's see what we capture on this now. Again, guys, a lot of people like say this is fake. It, it very well could be. This could be just a bunch of BS, but it's still fun to try out. So we're going to give it a shot and uh, let's see what we pick up. Yeah. Squibbity bitty bitty. Squibbity bitty. You got Chris is zooming in. Zoom, zoom. Sorry, guys, I'll get this. Make myself comfy on the big, comfy couch. This couch is pretty comfortable. Actually, when Lindsay was little, we used to watch a show called The Big, the comfy, big comfy Couch. The Big Comfy Couch, that's right. With Luna and Molly, a clown and her dolly on The Big Comfy Couch. Clean up time, right? Yeah. That show. All right. All right, now, should we, should we ask it for anything before we start this? I would like to know what was going on in here. There's okay. In this place had some crazy stuff happening. All right. When I was here. All right, so we got names, crazy stuff that happened here in the past. What is that? Oh, it's, you know what it is? I think that's the uh, air freshener. Do you hear something else? Maybe. Hmm. All right, we gotta listen to this. Maybe a tick, right? That's not what I... That's not what you're talking about? Okay. Sounds like talking. Okay. <clears throat> All right, necrophonic app. to your thing. Should I put it up here? So pick up. This is a cool explorer. We're sitting on a couch. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's a comfortable explorer. It's, it's a very comfortable explorer. It's a nice way to do things. It's not playing. Maybe your uh, volume's off? Okay, if there are any spirits that are in this mausoleum that want to tell us any information or why you might have done things in the past or some names, please fill us in. <laughs> Can you start off first by acknowledging us by our names? Can you say our names? So I'd like to, I'd like you to say.
Do you remember when I was here by myself and I did get hurt? Is there anything you'd like to tell us? Dr. Joe. Who am I? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Chris, it's in Chris right after that. That's crazy. Who am I? Hi, Joe. Hi, Joe. Dad, if you're here, can you come through? Do you try to protect me? You're dead. Help you. Mommy. cemetery tonight, what will we hear? What's out there? <clears throat> He's out there. Who's he? sitting there. <clears throat> Can you make anything move? Can you make that chair move behind me?
Devil. What is your name? Tom. Tom, Tom. 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 Tom, why do you why do you keep coming through, Tom? Are, are you Joe's father? His dad, he says. He's coming. Are you Joe's father? Love you, Joe. I really think your father is trying to come through. Because it's Joe, 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 Tom, Tom. Can you give us any kind of sign? You don't feel good, right? Yeah. You want to head outside? I don't know if it's the fumes in here. Yeah. I don't know if it's the fumes in here, guys. <clears throat> I don't feel good in here. Rob doesn't feel It seems like it's getting stronger. It feels like it's really, really hot in here. Yeah, it's getting, it's <laughs> definitely whatever. There's a real distinctive odor in here. And it's not, it's not sulfur or anything. It's just you know it's where, getting like a moldy. You know where I like to go? Where they have the, uh, all the Masonic symbols and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah. Let's see what talks about the um, talks about that. Um, yeah. Okay. We're gonna get out of here. Watch your step, guys. <clears throat> I'm gonna take. Uh, I'm gonna cut off for just one second. Take a quick break. Yeah. Cause uh, I need to get some water. There's that very foul odor in there. It just seems like it's getting stronger and stronger. You know, the air I don't believe is on right now because it's cooler out. So, uh, like I said, take a quick break, get some water, regroup, and then we're gonna head over to the other side and uh, see if we can pick up anything. Peace. All right, so we're in a different section of the um, of the cemetery now. Um, just so you guys know, when we cut off before to take a quick break, Rob got extremely sick. So. Uh, I didn't catch it. <laughs> Not that I want to, but it was. I feel bad for him. Just all of a sudden, he started getting uh, dry heaves, and then he started letting it go, blowing chunks. So we're over here in this section. I believe it's the Mason section. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, we're gonna run the app over here too. See if we can get anything here as well. Poor Rob. Joe was saying how, <clears throat> how, um, how some people say that Masons are connected to the Illuminati, but I don't know. I never heard that before, but then again, I never really paid much attention to it, so. 
so if you if you know anything about it let us know <clears throat> yep now, there's all different theories on this as I was mentioning some people believe that the Masons are like a secret society that is affiliated with as I was mentioning the Illuminati and different things like that <clears throat> I can't really say that for sure. What was that behind us? Mm -hmm. like an animal or something. Yeah, I can't say that for sure. What I can say is I'm curious to see if you can say anything about the Masons. I'm going to check out back there. I did hear something too. Mm-hmm. Anyone back here? Does anyone need help? <clears throat> Hello? That's a frog. That that last thing I think was a frog. <clears throat> you think that was that last? I don't know. If there's someone that needs help, please let us know. You hear that? It's kind of knocking. Oh boy! Oh gosh! That just that just <laughs> freaked me out. I'm not oh. <clears throat> Help me! All right, you want to do the uh, app on this yep. thing? It's been 16 years. Get me out of here. So I'm curious to see if we pick up any type of really any type of thing about the Masons. I'm also really curious to see if the name Tom comes through, our names. <clears throat> and this is a lot of fun, guys. We're just having fun. And at the same time, maybe, just maybe, we'll pick something up. Ready? Okay. Did we hear a little girl before us asking for help? Of the cemetery are we at? Break. I heard the name Bree again. Yeah. 
Bree, do you need help? Can you say our names? Can you tell us about the Masons? No. One thing I always wanted to ask the spirit box and why I stopped using it was I felt like something evil was coming into my life. Can you tell me what that was about? So now all of a sudden my stomach just started up on me, so I don't know. Maybe this isn't a good idea. I keep hearing my name on this thing, bro. I s Man, I, I'm gonna have to cut that out. That's weird. What? Well, it's gonna touch my arm. But there's something over there that like, sounded like it said Joe. There's something touching my damn arm. Are we uh, pushing the envelope here? I don't know. You know what? I think we should push the envelope a little bit. Oh, fucking Tom. Excuse me. I keep hearing Tom. <coughs> oh. What's going on, bro? Rep said it feels like something's touching his arm. What are you trying to tell us? What's going on? Oh man.
Uh oh. I'm shutting it. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here, but <clears throat> this is going to be some shaky footage and. <clears throat> So I ask if uh, if if um if we're pushing the envelope because you know some things just feel that maybe we shouldn't be doing. I don't know if this is one of them. <clears throat> just all of a sudden, my throat felt like it was locking up, <clears throat> and then my stomach just started churning. Um, could be just coincidental. Um, it's not like that hasn't happened before, but a little strange. I felt perfectly fine. I, I just, I don't get it. Um, <clears throat> felt like wasn't any specific sound or voice or anything, but it just felt like something behind us started, uh, just felt like someone was there. <clears throat> now Rob's saying something touched his arm. So I don't know. I don't know if we're um, diving into waters we shouldn't be. But it's gonna make me uh, think a little bit about doing this anymore with the uh, with the app. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's nothing. Maybe it's just me. It's coincidental because the first couple times we used it, it was fine. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Okay, anyway. Feeling a little better, I'm okay. So, by the way guys, what do you think of the uh, little earrings? <laughs> Today's my daughter's birthday and uh, we went to Claire's, which is like a girl's uh, store with, I'm sure you guys know what Claire's is. And we had a, a private party there, and all the girls from her Girl Scout troop told me they wanted to paint my nails and pierce my ears. So, me being the dad I am, I did so. So, I haven't had earrings in probably 30 years, so it's kind of funny. So, I'm going to try and be like the hip old man. Anyway, guys, we're going to move on. I think we might. Are we wrapping up? Okay, we're gonna. Oh, the other, there's another like outdoor mausoleum that we're gonna head to. <clears throat> yeah, the ominous skies makes for a good setting. Hey, Rob, has anybody told you today that your ass is looking fantastic? <laughs> <laughs> Let me be the first. <laughs> if not. <laughs> All right, Joe, your ass is looking good too. It's just not as plump as uh, Rob's. That was like a big plump ass. I like a nice, nice plump ass. Nice juicy, <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice juicy ass and blue eyes. <laughs> how you doing, Rob? Hey, how you doing? I think that was traffic, maybe. I can tell. This is this one's pretty. Uh, Pretty scary because when you're in the center of this mausoleum, 
what you'll hear is like so many echoes. And I picked up voices here before. Alright, you keep hearing that, it's like Ooh. Yeah. Be kind of cool. I'm just wondering, man, if, like I said, if we're in some uncharted waters, man. Yeah, we possibly might be. This watch out, Joe! Watch out! He's coming with me. Come on, let's play Frogger. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I'm, all right. I know I just said I'm doubting this and questioning whether or not the validity. Yeah, but let's just see because that was really strange. We've done it a few other times and nothing happened. It's probably I'd say just we just use the light of the phone, man. Okay. Just shut the light out. Yeah. Lights off, guys. It could just be a ghost. I mean, it could be echoes, like voices carry. Hush, hush, keep it down now. Voices carry. Voices carry. Oh. 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 oh, wait, where's the lighter? Yeah. Guess what? Look at that. There's somebody who was kind enough to leave us a candle. Please tell us, are there any spirits here tonight that wish to communicate through this app? <clears throat> a coward. Is that what it said, Chris? Are there any spirits here that want to tell us a message? Come to you in peace. We just ask that you would speak to us and tell us what 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 kind of messages you want to pass on. Tom. Tom again. It's an incident to do something.
I hear you talking. Can you can you be can you be a little more clear? Are you looking for someone? Who are you trying to find? What was that? It sounded like it, I don't know, it sounded like it says Tom again. <clears throat> Dad, when I was a little, when I was a little boy, what sport did you teach me how to play for hours in the backyard? I don't think you're really my dad. Are you really my dad? Or are you trying to trick me? Are you an evil spirit trying to trick me? What is with Tom? I hearing Tom every second. It's weird, guys. You keep hearing the name Tom. Joe? <clears throat> so I had a lot of people when I was at my grandparents' cemetery telling me that <clears throat> these are evil spirits that are coming through trying to um, you heard Joe asking if it was if it was uh, trying to trick them um, then again we don't know that this app is true but there's a lot of consistency in what we're hearing If that's the case, it would make a lot of sense. The devil. But now, I feel okay. I'm fine again. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and <clears throat> shut this off. Is there anything else you want to tell us?
good night. I say good night. Go to sleep. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna cut that off, guys, and kind of call it a night. I think. <clears throat> Make sure everybody's in agreement on that. Are you guys good? Yeah, so we'll go look over here and then we'll, we'll slide. But I think uh, I'm almost at 30 minutes, so. I'm gonna just cut off real quick, guys. Okay, back on. Yeah, I don't want it to be real. I, I just, uh, yeah, you know, that's another thing. Certain things, sorry, certain things you, or me personally, I want to not be real and not really happen or whatever. Um, so thinking that this app is just an app, um, sort of makes me not freak out so much. The weirdest I've gotten was the first time we used it in the trailer. Um, I just try and use mind over matter and um, just think that it's a force, but it's hard to say. Like I said, I investigated it. Um, I did <clears throat> did a lot of searches on it, and uh, everybody claims that this is real, but the whole Tom and Joe thing is really weird to me. So. There's another mausoleum that we can go into. Yeah, this one's really funky. Very small. Yeah. Much more smaller smaller than, than the other one. So that odor in there is just hard. It's a very damp, mildewy smell. I believe the problem is, is there's no air running right now. I mentioned earlier, it's just a cooler night in the winter here in Florida. So the air is set up to run automatically when the room reaches a certain temperature. Unfortunately, they don't have a, um, <clears throat> it's called a humidistat which when the humidity level reaches a certain point the air should go on which no matter what the temperature is that's the way it should work because here in florida humidity is so high so when the air is not running the humidity is still just as damp and high that you get that moldy smell and it's nasty so i'm gonna let them hang out in there i'm gonna do my thing out here just hang out with you. I think I'm gonna sign off because uh, I've had enough. <laughs> but it is a fun night. We do enjoy <clears throat> bringing these videos with the Necrophonic app. Um, I don't know if you overheard Joe saying on his uh, that it's fun. We have fun doing this. And anytime, again, that we're together, we always try and make the best of it and have a good time. That's what it's all about, so. And it's awesome that we we're able to bring that to you and share the good time with you, hopefully, and entertain you in the, in the meantime. But once again, guys, thank you so much. Um, I appreciate everybody watching my videos. I uh, appreciate all the nice comments um, after the junkyard video. 
but I am going to sign off. Please remember to check everything down below in the description. Say goodbye to the big boys. I will see you guys next time. Deuces.